I'm back, and uh, Paul Tapetti is back with me from PokerFace.com. As I just said, they support us. Uh, they put banners up for American Freedom Radio on their websites. Let's support them by getting their music and telling people about their music. You can learn a lot by just looking at their liner notes, let alone listening to the music. <laughs> Paul, I, I got this. Uh, I got a lot of letters for you guys. I'll read this, though. This, I think, kind of says it all. Jack, I ordered a CD from PokerFace. I was impressed by the response I got from Paul himself. I really thought it was great that he would take the time to email me and ask me why I bought the CD. My favorite is I'd Rather Die, which isn't on the new CD, which you played in front of uh, Ed and Elaine Brown on their front yard. I need yeah. to go to their site and order the latest one. Thanks for having Paul on your show, and that's uh, from our friend Matt, uh, who loves you guys too. So uh, if I could, hey, man, if we can get a few more CDs sold for you on the program today or any time, uh, I love doing that. I really feel like I'm helping the revolution by promoting people like you. Well, God bless you, brother, you know, and I think it's time for uh, Jack Blood Deadline Live link on the front page, too, man. Well, uh, American Freedom Radio will work, and you, you put me in the liner notes, so uh, I can't. <laughs> if I, it would take me an hour to go over all the bands that have been inspired by our show. I'll pat myself on the back, who uh, put us in the liner notes, and that really means a lot to us. I, I don't know, you know, it just means a lot to me that people are acknowledging my work, so if I can go back and, and do the same for you, uh, not a problem. Hey, I'm trying to, uh, I got a, a computer problem here, and I want to give people the new address for Ed and Elaine Brown. But uh, talk for a minute again about what it was like to be under the helicopters there and and just to, to be in that place at that time, because I thought that that was a, kind of a quintessential moment for freedom. Um, well, we took it seriously, man. You know, for us, we, we believe no more Wacos, you know, where the government acts as judge, jury, and executioner. Um, all four of us were, were uh, we had our bulletproof, Bulletproof vest song for at least like for the song, and um, funny the the homeland insecurity copter got lower when it was uh, our set. And I told uh, Ed Brown, I was like, "This is poker face fans trying to get a, get a good listen on, you know." <laughs> yeah, and that's in the video. By the way, folks, if you missed that or you haven't seen the videos, you guys have a bunch of those up on your MySpace. Uh, give that address out so people can go check out what it was like back in the day to fight for freedom. Uh, poker, uh, see, myspace.com forward slash would be poker face music, one word. Poker and uh, face one thing about the music. new disc, brother, could you could you honor us and uh, do do a review, Jack Bless style, please? Oh, I will, for sure. Yeah. Uh, oh, you rock. Shoot me an email or give me a call or something and remind me because i got a lot of things I'm working on. I would love to do that. Let's give out this. Uh, I just got this today from Travis Doss, a, a good friend of ours here. Elaine Alice Brown, register number. 03924-049 FMC Cars Well Federal Medical Center PO Box 27137 Fort Worth Texas 76127 and Edward Brown register number 03923-049 FMC Devens Federal Medical Center they got him in the uh, medical hold up too P.O. Box 879, Air, Massachusetts. Uh, they're keeping them as far apart as possible. A-Y-E-R, Massachusetts, 01432. I'm going to post this uh, this up in a special bulletin at DeadlineLive.info because it would be great, Paul, if all of our listeners just sent them a, a letter and said, you know what, we never forgot you, we, we thank you for your sacrifice. And maybe if we had a million more like you, Ed and Elaine Brown, we wouldn't be in the trouble we're in today. That's right, man. And uh, shoot me the info, and I'll post it on uh, on our political prisoners uh, part of our forum board. Boy, and they're adding up, aren't they? Oh, dude, it just makes me sick, man. I guess maybe we'll be next. I don't know. I mean, I, I don't worry about that. Do you? No, brother. I believe in God, and if God wants me to, to be there, then I'll be there. If not, I'll, I'll be outside doing what I'm supposed to be doing, making music. You'll do. You'll do. You'll spread your message in prison if that's where it has to be. Everywhere I go, brother, you know it. Or in heaven. <laughs> yeah. God forbid. Brother, don't worry about it, man. You know, we, we fight the good fight, and I'd rather be here at this time time in history than any other, you know? Doesn't it? And me too. Doesn't it feel good to do this? I mean, I, just to my listeners who might be tuning in, and, and maybe they don't know what we talk about a lot of the time, but I just want to get this out there, that it feels good to, to take a hit back. Instead of hiding with your head in the sand in a cave somewhere or up in the mountains and just, and just you know, I, they'll, they'll never get me. Instead of being scared all the time, doesn't it feel good to be on the offensive and to take chunks out of their ass?
classes? Brother, it's the only, only place to be, man. You know, and if you're not on any list, then you're not doing a good enough job for America is how I say it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to up my game, Paul. Yeah, brother. <laughs> Keep up with the game. Of, with our new instrument, brother, I think, uh, I think we just went up to the top of the list, man. <laughs> <laughs> and the show will not be on next week, folks, because we had Paul on from Poker Face and uh, everything that went with it. Well, listen, man, g give my best again uh, to all your brothers out there. Uh, one of the great achievements of Poker Face is that you guys have stayed together as a band for so many years. That, that's a really hard thing to do, and I think everybody that listens to this show that's a musician in a band, they, they fully appreciate that. That's not, a, that's not an easy achievement, and you guys stayed together, and you made all this great music. As I say, you guys are historical in this, in this movement for freedom. Thank you very much. Brother, God bless you, man. There he goes, folks. And I didn't get to. We'll do this on Monday. People are so busy recruiting Ron Paul for 2012. There's a, I'll put this on DeadlineLive.info. You can vote on who should be his running mate. I guess it's a foregone conclusion. We'll hit that and go to DeadlineLive.info because there is just massive amounts of news that we didn't get to. Huge breaking stories we didn't even get to on the program today. I promise you we'll get to them next week if we're here and if that's supposed to be. Folks, you have a great weekend. Love your family. Love yourselves. I'll see you next time. Until then, I'm Jack Blood, your radio gun, saying be bold and mighty forces will come to your aid. <laughs>